Just take a, cu a couple of these, okay? You don't feel badly about this at all, do you? We have declared war. War it will be. Now I need you ruthless, not soft. Stefan Cassidyne, I am placing you under arrest for the murder of Catherine Bell. Maybe you need to, to be kidnapped or raped to feel important to somebody. Stop that! I am your mother! What are these? They're pain pills. I wouldn't give them to you unless they were safe. Why do you just have them in your pocket? Um, you know, my hand, sometimes my hand, it flares up, that's all. Still? Um, does your neck hurt or doesn't it? You said it hurts. Oh my God, I can't believe this. Neither can I. What happened? Were you falling asleep? Asleep? No, of course not. But didn't you see the tree? Didn't you see that we were going off the roof? I don't know. I don't know, all right? Oh. oh, God, Emily, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my God, we could have been killed. I don't... I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know what's the matter. Everything I do, it goes wrong. Everything. People expect too much from me. I expect too much from me. I fight with your mother all the time. All the time, you walked in on us before we were fighting. We had the most terrible fight. We fight all the time, but it takes a terrible toll on me. You know, trying to keep up appearances. For God's sake, I'm only human. Oh, God almighty. She's never gonna forgive me when she hears about this. It's just an accident, Dad. It's just an accident. <laughs> Do you understand these rights as I just explained them to you? Yes. Why, why are you doing this? You can't have the evidence. <laughs> why aren't you arresting Luke Spencer right now? Nicholas, please, leave us. You are all invited back to headquarters for the next installment of you our story. You have no witnesses, no motive. Why would he kill Catherine Bell? Counselor, what, you think we came here for guidance? We'll be happy to discuss the specifics, but not here. Hands behind your back, sir. Oh, please. Nicholas, what inside the house. Don't. Well, why are you asking me to stay? I am not asking, I am commanding it. <clears throat> behind your back. I was getting worried. Yeah. It took a long way. You forgot something. The bread and meat and stuff you were bringing from your dad's club? Couldn't get it. I'll have to go back after closing. That's OK. Oh, I saw your father at the hospital. He said he needs to see you. He said to say that it's a family emergency. I'm sorry, Dad. It's too late to put out that fire. My mom's back. He's just afraid that I'd run into her first, and I did. Oh. How'd it go? Was she happy to see you? Yeah. Are you happy to see her? She's my mother.
How dare you deliberately keep me in ignorance when my family is strained to the breaking point and my son has been missing for months. He wasn't missing, Laura. He just wasn't here. What else did he tell you? He told me that Nicholas had been shot at your club. Yes, he was, but not by me, and it wasn't fatal. What was that? Is that an excuse or a joke? What would you have done if you had known? I would have come home, obviously. The kid didn't want you here. How do you know? Because he said so. He could have written you a letter. He could have contacted you. I know he gets letters from you. Or he could have had his uncle do it. Never mind what Nicholas said. You are my husband. You know how I feel about both of my sons. And if they were in pain, I had a right to know. Not telling me. It's a violation of trust. What else did Lucky say? He accused me of I don't know what kind of perversion for marrying you. Well, we always said he was bright for his age. General Hospital, brought to you by Walt Disney's 10th animated classic, Melody Time, filled with music, fun, and fantasy on video for the first time ever. In the tradition of Disney's greatest musicals, Walt Disney's 10th animated masterpiece is coming to video for the first time ever, Melody Time, featuring one of your favorite Disney characters, Donald Duck. Now, for the very first time on video, you'll want to share these timeless, colorful musical stories with your family. Don't miss your chance to celebrate the 50th anniversary of Walt Disney's Melody Time. On sale tomorrow. We asked people to try a pasta dinner. Delicious. Very good. What's the name of it? Hamburger Helper, four cheese lasagna. Hamburger Helper? Can we have a Hamburger Helper tonight? Four cheese lasagna it is. Try Hamburger Helper, four cheese lasagna, or new cheesy hash browns. This is dinner tonight. <laughs> When you combine Reese's Peanut Butter Cups and Crispy Wafers, the combination is irresistible. Introducing Reese Sticks, the crisp you can't resist. Last week, price-conscious shoppers were given this mystery detergent to try. They had no idea it was gain. Surprise! What's your name? Tracy Jones. Do, do you have anything you've washed in this? My son's socks. Okay. I like how it gets the clothes white. And my daughter holds on to it and hugs it and smells it and said, Mom, it smells good. It smells Smell great. it with me here, ready? <laughs> oh, yeah. So I wonder what's in this? Does yeah. all that? Gay. Hey! Yes. So you're sure you're going to switch? I will switch. Fresh scent remind you of anything? Yeah, my mom washing my clothes. Step on. Now you don't have to clean your dishes twice. Introducing Electrosol Automatic Dishwasher Tabs. It's a perfectly measured two-layered tablet that dissolves completely. The blue layer breaks up stuck-on foods. The white layer gently scrubs your dishes till they shine, giving you dishes that look like this the first time. Electrosol Tabs, the next dimension of clean. If you thought my last white sale was the most colorful ever, you haven't seen anything yet. We've added new sheet designs, 100% Egyptian cotton towels, new jacquard woven kitchen designs, new shears, and lace curtain designs. And everything's color coordinated to mix and match. Martha Stewart's Everyday Collection, now on sale at Kmart. You could say we've extended the line. The line. Tonight, look what our cameras caught. Secret, amazing, startling. Is God really here? They say it's the answer to all their prayers. Plus, is this a bizarre way to make a living or what? These people are renting their bodies to science. Go inside the world of these human guinea pigs. Watch 2020 Monday at 9, 8 Central. Our child is missing. It's the one story of the year that had every critic raving about blue. This guy is a monster, boy. The season's most compelling blue, ABC Tuesday. You have something you want to tell me? Lucky found out. 
I'm sorry. I didn't want him to, but he did. Who said that there was anything to find out? Look, when he came to you, what did he say? He said he was sick of lies. And in that moment, so was I. But, no, before that, what brought it up? I mean, who put this in his head? Oh, well, that would be your darling other son. Nicholas. No, that's yes, not possible. Yes, yes. And our son acted like our son. He scoped it out. He asked questions. He checked the facts. And he wasn't just doing some academic exercise. He wasn't just looking up a four-letter word. He's got this friend, Elizabeth yeah, Weber. Yeah, he told and... me about that. I know. Well, by the time it got around to me, it was just a little late to try and turn it into an inspirational tale. Why didn't you call me? I mean, you should have called me that day, that minute. Why didn't you? Because I didn't... Because it seemed that it didn't concern you. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, what did it concern if not me and us and what our whole family is about? Laura, it's about men and power. It's about a young man coming into his power and an old man who abused his. It's about Lucky's hero worship crashing and burning and him hating my guts for it and me letting him because just maybe that's the first step to him being a better man than his father was. He's got this rage that I understand. I can even be proud of it. But I, I felt that I had to get you out of his line of fire, not only because it was fair, but because that is my job. Oh, okay. <laughs> I get it. I get it. I, I gave birth to two sons, and neither one of them is my business. Huh? You know, you made me choose between Nicholas and this family. And I did it. I went to him, and I told him I could be nothing more than a distant relative to him. And now what you're telling me is that the best I can hope for is to be, oh, I don't know, sort of peripheral in our son's life? You let him walk out that door without giving me the slightest clue that I might have lost another son. As long as he loves you enough to despise me, you haven't lost him. But... But how can anything be put right this way? You should have forced him to stay here and just work it out. Darling, I don't force the people I love anymore. It doesn't work. It makes them angry. It makes them mistrustful. It even makes them secretive. Look, baby, I did the best I could. Next time, when it's Lulu's turn, we'll do it your way. When I was home last week, you let me believe that he was sleeping down the hall while you made love to me. <sighs> Have I been gone that long? Do I even know who you are anymore? That's always been your particular kindness, to know and to forget. <sighs> I shouldn't have broken down like that. Half the things that I said to you weren't true anyway. Well, you're probably just in shock, which could be serious. I know that. I'm not even a doctor. How can you be so forgiving? How can you be consoling me after all the times I've disappointed you, been unfair to you after this? Well, you'll have to remember I was a disappointment to you, too, once. Never. I look at this windshield and I think to myself what could have happened. And I am no better 
Then AJ, I'm only more sanctimonious. Now wait, Dad. This is nothing like what happened to Jason. For one thing, no one got hurt. What about your neck? No, I'm fine now. And you're not drunk. Right. Right. So? Who says Mom has to know either? I mean, we can start the car and see if it'll get us back to the house, which it probably will. We can park it down by the south gate, walk up to the house, and you can get up early in the morning and take it to get fixed. You would do that for me? Of course. What's the point of you and Mom fighting over something as dumb as this? I mean, the only thing I got hurt was the car, and all that takes is money. Mm. Oh, unless are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I think... I think I just strained a back muscle, that's all. It's nothing. Well, here, take these. Um... No, why don't you hang on to those? I have others, you know, in case your neck bothers you. We'll have to keep an eye on that. Okay, this will be between you and me. Us, okay? Absolutely. Just between us. Give me one good reason why a bail hearing can't be set while you do the booking. I'll have someone call Assistant D.A. Jensen, and you two can work it out to your mutual satisfaction. Mr. Cassidyne, would you like to make a statement at this time? No, he would not. I may be handcuffed, but I haven't been gagged. I demand to be allowed to make one phone call. That is one of my remaining so-called rights, is it not? Officer Willis? Yes. See to it, this man gets a phone call. Could you uh, see if Miss Jensen could join us for a minute? Yes, sir. Look, while we're waiting for Miss Jensen, I'd like to ask you a few questions, if you don't mind. I mind. I'll be doing the speaking around here. Now, I actually would like you to do some talking about the evidence that you have against my cousin. Only the de facto murder weapon. A handy little dagger, just the right strength and thickness for loosening old mortar, found in Stefan Cassidyne's study. Hey, Mom, what's DEET? You don't need DEET with Avon Skin So Soft Insect Repellents. Aroni in new low-fat flavors. So Nicoderm CQ is working for you. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm doing just fine, cold turkey. Oh well, that's great. Oh, yeah. Hey Jack. Yeah. Take a break. Oh, nice one. Come on, you know we quit. <sighs> oh wait, I'm coming. Jack, no. Just one cigarette. No. Why are you so calm? Because I got help. CQ, a 24-hour stream of medicine that's always with you, even when you first wake up. Helps calm the cravings, my friend. All right. Nicoderm CQ, the power to calm, the power to comfort, the power to help you quit. Watch their eyes light up to a world of imagination. Kids love new color wipe-offs from Crayola. They color for hours with special washable markers. And the color wipe-off board that lets them color again and again, and again. Take the time to see Look for the whole line of new color wipe-offs. There's only one childhood and only one Crayola. Feeding your baby gives her all the nutrients she needs to grow strong. But when you give her an ordinary bottle, you could be increasing the risk of ear infections, too. Oh. Johnson's Health Flow bottles are uniquely angled to promote the semi-upright feeding position, reducing fluid in the inner ear and the risk of ear infections. Breastfeeding is best, but if you give your baby a bottle, give her one that helps prevent ear infections too. Johnson's Health Flow. From Johnson & Johnson. New swimsuits, because I'm teaching my kids to swim. I need tons of tank tops. I gotta have cool shorts. There are lots of smart reasons to shop the JCPenney Summer Sale. JCPenney. 
Save now on what you need to look totally hot this summer. I'm sliding into summer. We're doing three theme parks. I'm going to science camp. The summer sale. Styles that help you look good. Prices that make you look smart. Your Honor, I'm guilty. One man's confession. Dad, don't! This is all wrong. One man's conspiracy. It's postmarked the same day that Georgie was murdered. He did it. I knew he did it. One man's guilt. Todd is the killer. You're free to go. Why? There's another suspect. They're the men to watch. One Life to Live, ABC Daytime. Do you deny that it's yours, Mr. Cassidy? Of course not. Can't you see what an obvious hoax has been committed? I have no doubt you found mortar dust on it, and no doubt you found it in my desk, because Luke Spencer meant for you to. What possible motive would he have for killing a woman that he planned to marry? Oh, that's some love story, all right. Begins with a shooting by someone that, strangely enough, Catherine never got around to naming. How do we know that this grand romance wasn't just some blind to keep her quiet? Of course, she's a lot quieter now, isn't she? Oh, that's insane. Anyone can see that he and Catherine are devoted to each other. They are practically inseparable from the day that they met. That's not how some of us remember it. Nicholas, please, no good can come of your being here. I'm not leaving here until you do. Ooh. Be prepared to pay rent. Right, so your vision of their relationship was like a Marx Brothers movie. He kept trying to kill her and kill her until he got it right. And I cleverly arranged for my fiance to be dealt the coup de grace in front of hundreds of witnesses. In fact, so great was my criminal genius that after rendering the railing unstable with a curio easily traceable to me, I dropped it into my desk instead of into the lake. Not so dumb if you plan to frame Luke Spencer for framing you. Yeah, you're a second guesser. I'd bet money that's the way you'd go. You are either an egregious simpleton or you're allied with Spencer yourself. Why don't you ask Luke Spencer if he wants to be allied with me and see what he says? Stop leering at me and keep your distance. Or you're gonna what? What are you gonna right. do, Stephon? All right. What are you gonna do All to me? All right. I never took you for a bully, Mac. Having someone I care about murdered is not an improving experience for me. Mr. Cassidyne, welcome to the system. I hope you like the looks of us because we'll be seeing a lot of each other for a long time to come. She didn't know. Your mother? Somebody, I don't know, I guess your grandmother told her I wasn't living at home. Everything else was a, a shock to her. Like why I left. It's pretty cool of your father not to mourn her. She just would have been ready with some excuse. Well, since she wasn't What'd she say? She makes excuses for him, he makes excuses for her. What's the point? I already know. It's too late to keep lying. Maybe they don't think they are. Then how screwed up is that? In her version, nobody did anything. It's just all circumstances. We'll believe that and there's no right or wrong, there's no love or rape. It's just all bad timing. Lucky they've been married a long time and they've been happy. What was that? Sick. Sick. But you didn't think so before all this. You were happy. Well, I like Santa Claus and the Tooth Fairy, too. But there's no inviting them back. They built a marriage and a home and a family on something that is just wrong. It's just too sick to live with, so they covered it up. But just because they hid it does not mean it went away. So, what? Someone who was raped as a kid? That's all I can ever be? No. What if your mother found a way out, a way not to be that anymore? Then I would want to know how. She married her rapist. How is that a way out? You're not trying to see it the way they do. You're right. I'm not. Then how can it ever be fixed?
to find it. What if I could get inside their heads? What would that mean about me? That you love them? That you're trying to understand? No, no. I mean, what if I put myself in my father's shoes? And they fit. Elizabeth Weber. That's how this all got started. Yeah, lucky you found her in the park and brought her here. The park? Near the fountain. How old is she? Fifteen. Is she okay? No. They never caught the man. Of course, that happens. And then there's no chance of anything like justice being served. It's just this unresolved public atrocity, I guess. But then how would I know? The guy did quite a number on her. I'm not sure she told anybody but Lucky. Well, there was Barbara. Uh, Lucky took off that night and went and found Bra Barbara and brought her back so she could uh, examine the girl, and I think that was a good idea. She's so young. Ah, oh, Laura, she's so young. She's got this dark hair and these big eyes and baby skin, and I... I look at her, and all I can think is maybe that's what Lulu will... Lucky sort of lived through it with her, and it's left him with this boiling anger that he doesn't know what to do with. I mean, he had this friend, and she was funny, and she was fearless one day, and the next day she wasn't any of those things, and then he came to me. And he wanted me to say something. He wanted me to do something to help. <laughs> he wanted to go find the guy that had done it and kill him because of what he had killed in Elizabeth. Bobby thought I should tell him right then. But I didn't agree, and I, I still don't. I, I, I don't think one thing has anything to do with the other. Now, maybe that's just self-serving, but then who am I to say, huh? Of course you shouldn't have told him. What the hell was Bobby thinking? She, why doesn't she just mind her own business? Oh. What, what I don't understand is made you change your mind? Lucky started making connections between what he was seeing happening to Elizabeth and what he... what he thinks happened to you with the Cassidines. And then, one day he crossed paths with Nicholas and he shot off his mouth and said that Stavros was a rapist and then Nicholas took it upon himself to set the record straight. Uh, yeah, but still... Still? Honey, still? Our son came to me and asked me flat out, what did you want me to do, lie to him? I, I don't see any reason why you would have to. Because to tell him the truth was to tell him I raped you. What? How can you say that? How can you say that to me? Of all people. How can I not say that to you, of all people? Uh, it, 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 it's just not that simple. You know that. I never said it was simple. I said it was rape. Stop it! Will you just stop that? You don't get to just write the history of my life. Wasn't I even there? I mean, oh, I see. You think that I was just too young and too stupid to know what was happening to me. Back then, everybody was in such a hurry to put words in my mouth. And you're doing it. You're doing it now. No more. No more. Laura, have you never said the word? 
Not even to yourself in the dark? No, I, I don't have any need to see myself or you in black and white. Well, Nicholas must have heard it somewhere. Stefan. Yeah, Stefan, and where did he hear it if not from you? You see, we come back around again, full circle to the source. And baby, who could blame you in the middle of some lonely soul-bearing moment to say it? You thought I was dead anyway. But if you ask why our son is gone and why he spits on both of us, that is the answer. You don't need a license for hair like this. All you need is Preference by L'Oreal. Stay true colorants that resist fading mean my color won't fade out. Special conditioners mean my hair won't dry out. With Preference, I love my color, and I'm worth it. Fade resistant Preference by L'Oreal. My mom says I look just like the Gerber baby. I've changed a bit, and so has Gerber. Now they don't have any added sugar or starch in over 100 recipes. Shouldn't your baby be a Gerber baby? Toenail artist. Today's theme? Happy feet. Think she's gonna wanna hide those tootsies? I'm thinking she's thinking sandals. So where do I go to get a sandals and stay within my budget? Pay less. Now all $9.99 sandal and canvas shoes are just $8.99. Two pair, $7.99 each. Three or more, $6.99 each. At the Pay Less Shoe Source Buy More Pay Less Sale. Toe art really needs exposure. <laughs> Please tell me this is a phase. Doesn't it feel good to pay less? Ooh, nice breath. Breath savers? Even if it's been a while since your last breath saver, don't worry. Breath savers. Works even after the mint is gone. The new Slumber Time Soother with remote control. The first soother you can activate out of baby's sight. With the Slumber Time Soother, you can help him to sleep without waking him up. Works like a dream. General Hospital will continue in a moment here on ABC. Ten News wants to send you to a private screening of Disney's new animated feature, Mulan, at Disneyland. Just send a postcard with your name, address, and phone number to Ten News. Then watch Ten News Midday at 11 a.m. the week of June 15th. If you see your name, you get a family four-pack of passports to a special screening of Mulan at Disneyland. Once you see the movie, experience the magic of Mulan in the new Disneyland nighttime parade. It's Mulan Magic from Disneyland and Ten News. Not everyone can make great barbecue. You gotta have the right tools, the right attitude, the right music. You especially gotta have the right barbecue sauce. Garlic, molasses, onions, spices. KC Masterpiece. Don't be fooling with some dressed up ketchup. Get the real stuff. Then everyone loves you. KC Masterpiece is barbecue. Be sure to try new Thicker Recipe Hickory, too. When I graduated from Carlmont High School in 1965, California ranked fifth in the nation in school funding. Our schools were the best. Today, California ranks at the bottom. That's wrong. Some state officials say there's nothing we can do. Well, I'm here to tell them, yes, there is. We can fight to get school funding up to the national average and demand higher standards, smaller classes, and the best teachers. I'm Delane Easton, and I'm fighting to make our schools great again. It's Jerome's Sofa Spectacular. Now's the time for store-wide savings on sofas, sofa sleepers, and reclining sofas. Jerome's Sofa Spectacular ends Monday at 9 p.m. Local San Diego news. Professional, accurate, clear. Experience you can trust. You get it only on 10 News. Do you think that I would do that? Speak to an outsider about the most intimate and, and difficult things between us? And paint you all in one color like a criminal? Like an animal in his eyes? Laura, you were alone. His brother's captive. He was sympathetic. He was commanded by Stavros, like you. He was ground under Helena's heel, like you. Maybe you didn't think of him as an outsider. 
He was. And he wasn't, I mean... He, he was kind to me. Almost like a friend. He was really my only friend. You have to understand, I... I was taken away from everything that I knew or that I loved. I thought that you were dead. So, yes, I confided in him. And we did the, the things you do. We, we told each other our stories. And he asked about you and, and how we met and how we fell in love. You know, kind of questions that anybody would ask. Yes. But how did he get the answers that nobody else could? That was his own interpretation. I mean, that, that must have just been him jumping to conclusions. I don't know. I guess, I guess maybe, maybe I stumbled over that one bad night and then he just assumed the rest or, you know, he put his own label on it. I, I swear to you, Luke, I swear. Wait, 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 wait. One bad night? That's how you remember it? That's what we had. I haven't forgotten, Luke. No, I'm not delusional, and I don't have a, a psychological block. I know what I said to Jesse, and to the police, and, and to Scotty. But Luke, I was, our marriage is as old as I was then. And it speaks with as much authority. When we were falling in love, we had one bad night. Oh, Laura. And I will not go back there. I will not relive it. Not for you, not for Lucky, not for anyone. You're afraid. Yes. Because you think that maybe you could do the same thing he did? Lucky, that's not true. They're my parents. They made me. I am them. No, no. rape is not inherited. It's not in your genes. Well, don't they say that abusers pass it on? Generation to generation, aren't there statistics? Elizabeth, I spent my whole life wanting to be like him, exactly like him. What if I am? What if I am? I think about it all the time. Then don't! What if I have too much to drink? What if I think I'm gonna die and I see some girl I have a crush on or God forbid an obsession with? What if there's music playing or I'm walking through the park and I see some girl sitting on a bench and I think to myself, why not? No one would know about Lucky, it. listen to me. You could never do that. And even if you don't know it, I do. Maybe you don't know me. Maybe you just think just you do. Just stop. Stop this. Jeez, Lucky, you slept on my floor by my bed, and you watched over me while I was sleeping. It was like the, an angel came to Earth to help me. I trust you with my life. Those voices in your head, I know what those are. Those are the voices that tell me that was my fault that I got raped. But you wouldn't let them. And now I'm gonna do the same thing for you. Do you hear me? Do you? She won't budge on the bail issue, and I, I can't get a hearing till first thing in the morning. I'm afraid you're going to have to spend at least a night here. No. No, I'll put up any amount of Nicholas. security they ask. Nicholas. Everything that we have, Alexis. Nicholas. I can speak to a judge first thing in the morning. It won't be necessary, Alexis. My attorney is here now. 
Good evening, Commissioner. Let it be understood that any interrogation of my client is to cease immediately. Nicholas, will you any give statements you may have given, alone, I will consider them under duress. I'm sorry, I, um, I, I just assume... You misunderstand. I need you for something more important. For Nicholas. I won't have him see me go through the humiliation of being fingerprinted and photographed. I want you to take him home and stay with him. I will, I will. Without my protection, he is vulnerable to Spencer, to Elena. You'll do this for me. He wants me to take you home. You can't just leave him here, Alexis. Nicholas, it's physical agony for him to have you see him like this. There's nothing we can do tonight other than leave him as much pride as possible. A woman's body is about 70% water, yet it's natural to occasionally experience personal dryness. KY Liquid is water-based, non-sticky. It's from the number one doctor-recommended brand, KY Liquid. You're not taking any chances. You're taking a calcium supplement. But which one, Citrical or Oscal? You'd need two big Citricals to surpass the absorbable calcium in one Oscal. And Oscal's proven effective in more clinical studies. Don't take chances. Take Oscal. Look what Daddy gets. Looks good, huh? You eat those peas. This is daddy. When you make a Spamburger hamburger. Oh my. Watch out. Perfect. Because the premium pork and ham, spiced to perfection, makes Spam so good, it's gone. <laughs> Spam so good, it's gone. Some place where there isn't any trouble. Do you suppose there is such a place, Toto? Somewhere. Wash the world away. Start again. Clean. You're protected by Dial. The most trusted antibacterial soap of all. Doesn't that feel better? Want you to work the body? Yeah, and the head. You gonna crush him like a peanut? Like a little peanut! You gonna kill him! Yeah. Even a knuckle sandwich isn't a sandwich without the tangy zip of Miracle Whip. What do you want? Brownies. Thick, moist, fudgy, chocolatey, home-baked brownies. A whole lot of them. You want new Duncan Hines Thicker, Moister, Chewy Fudge Brownies. The thickest, moistest brownies Duncan Hines has ever made. Ah, the smell of them. Oh, the mm. taste of them. Brownies that leave nothing to be desired, except maybe more. Duncan Hines' new Thicker, Moister, Chewy Fudge Brownies. Just what you want. Mm. The practice exposed. Step out of the car, please. Oops. I'm completely innocent. No matter how you look at it. Did James Berluti really solicit you for sex? Yes. The more you practice. We had a little incident. What incident? Jimmy got arrested. The better it gets. I'm completely innocent. The practice, ABC Tonight. Tomorrow, ever consider that the spices in your kitchen may actually help you live longer? We'll tell you about the power of spice. On Good Morning America. Tomorrow. I want security fully staffed on all shifts. I won't take any chances. So what? You just let Luke win again? Huh? Can you now see that this is his fault, Alexis? It's certainly credible. <gasps> credible? It's a fact. Can you now see why my father and my grandmother hated Luke so much? Huh? He's gonna burn for this. You should sit down. Yeah. We 
You also ought to get some ice on your neck. No, my neck's fine now. It's going to be worse tomorrow. How's Michael? Uh, He's just prepping for a meeting tomorrow. Oh, um, Michael's fine. He's a beautiful little baby. Very happy. Yeah. Has Jason ever put that boy to bed? <clears throat> well, yeah, it's just that, um, we stayed up a little late. He ordered some pizza. The three of us started talking and... The three of you? Oh, not Dad. He... He stayed in the car. It was, um, Jason and Robin and I. <laughs> you waited in the car the entire evening? Um, uh, no, he went and got something to eat. Right, Dad? Yeah, I didn't want any trouble. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> yeah, that makes two of us. <clears throat> Dad, you coming up? No, I'm gonna sit here for a while. Good night. What's going to be worse tomorrow? Take your pick. How are we going to get Lucky back home again where he belongs? That's what we should be discussing. Well, you saw him. What does that mean? Well, it's going to be a little tough getting the toothpaste back in the tube, don't you think? Look, Laura, I didn't want to open Pandora's box, believe me. But I had no choice. The monster walked in this house and took up residence here. Now, what are you going to do? You're going to say to the boy, just forget it. Come on home. Unmake your bed. It's not going to work. And I'm sorry if you feel that I did the wrong thing, if you feel that I gave him a false version of what happened that night, but you... there we are. No, 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 no. This is not about what happened 20 years ago. This is about what's going on right now today, which is your choosing to shut me out of both of my son's lives. That is the part that I find unacceptable. I had a right to help Lucky through this. How? Laura, you can't even say the word. You can't even say it to me. No, there no, There are certain I'm not things gonna, you no, can't help. I'm not going to let you turn this into anything that it isn't, OK? This is about one thing. You deliberately misled me. At best, at worst, you flat out lied to me. And I resent it. I resent it more than I can say. I think you're expressing yourself fairly clearly. <sighs> Look. Maybe this evening would go a lot smoother for both of us if I just go to the club. If you must. Party, Susan. Thanks, Brad. Mom, can I have some more to eat? Sure, sweetheart. Do torches and candles bring too much togetherness to your get-togethers? Spread out with new Off Mosquito Coil, the newest off you don't put on. Each coil repels bugs ten times further than candles, which makes the great outdoors even greater. Make your yard a virtually bug-free zone with new Off Mosquito Coil. Keeps bugs off. S.C. Johnson Wax. The farmers have been bringing us their harvest for 45 years. Then the farm co-op brought me something different. <laughs> News that soybeans like ours could be used to make a cooking oil fry up snack chips without adding any fat or calories. At Crisco, they figured without all the fat of regular chips, this Olean could help lots of people eat a little healthier. Well, all I say is doing good starts right in your own backyard. New fat free Olean, a good place to start. Those fingers in your hair That sly come hither stare That look that lures them there it's witchcraft Only finesse shampoo with hydrating silk protein Smooths every strand for the silkiest hair you've ever touched Those gorgeous flowing strands of it I've got to get my hands on it Silk it's Protein witchcraft. Finesse, get the look that gets the touch Comes 
help. Improved Huggies Ultra Trim Diapers, the only leading diaper with barriers at legs and waist, designed to fight even the messiest leaks all around. All clear with Improved Huggies Ultra Trim, America's first line of defense against leaks. What the? For all those times you wished you had a camera, get the only one-time use camera loaded with Kodak Max Film. Hold it. Because no matter how difficult your subject is, gotcha. You blinked. You'll get better pictures more often. One more. Smile. Never mind. I think I got it. Max one-time use cameras from Kodak. Maybelline asks, what are the smartest lips saying this season? Pro vitamin A. Vitamin E. Major moisture. New Moisture Whip lipstick from Maybelline. The latest to drool for colors. Drenched with 40% moisturizers. Now zapped with lip perfecting Pro Vitamin A. For smooth, supple, saucy lips. In all the rage shades. Now you're talking traffic stopping lips. New Moisture Whip lipstick from Maybelline. Maybe she's born with it. Ten News wants to send you to a private screening of Disney's new animated feature, Mulan, at Disneyland. Just send a postcard with your name, address, and phone number to Ten News. Then watch Ten News Midday at 11 a.m. the week of June 15th. If you see your name, you get a family four-pack of passports to a special screening of Mulan at Disneyland. Once you see the movie, experience the magic of Mulan in the new Disneyland nighttime parade. It's Mulan Magic from Disneyland and Ten News. Stay tuned for scenes from the next General Hospital. Meet Charlotte. She likes pizza, goldfish, and riding her Power Wheels rock and roll machine. She recently moved from rocking to rolling, and she's enjoying her newfound independence. Meet Oliver. He likes spaghetti, spiders, and the freewheeling lifestyle of his roadster. 
even if his mom controls how fast he goes. Charlotte, meet Oliver. Fisher Price presents our youngest line of power wheels, the all new My First Roadster and the Rock and Roll Machine. For Charlotte and Oliver, it was love at first sight. I did a great deal of research on the automobile. I looked at the Honda Civic, Ford Probe. I always came back to Hyundai. Right now, an Elantra is just $9,499, plus factory options like air conditioning, alloy wheels, and moonroof for just half price. I love the design of the Elantra. It's sleek, classy, car of the 90s. I got everything I wanted with this car. It impressed me completely. Take a test drive and experience it yourself. Want to know a juicy secret? Lowry's Marinades. Herbs, spices, and a splash of fruit juice. Ready to grill in just 30 minutes. Lowry's Marinades. The fruit juice makes the difference, and the difference is delicious. Hey, Miami, Dr. Scholz wants to know, how do you treat your feet? Being in the sun, my feet and legs take a beating. Really dry. We have a new crack skin repair cream. It has a moisture attracting ingredient to help repair dry crack skin. Very soft. Nice. Do you have someone at home to give you a foot massage? No, but I'll find somebody. <laughs> hey, check this out. It's the new Nice and Easy from Clairol. Now the conditioner travels with the color in a rich conditioning color cream. So you get color that's absolutely fabulous. Stop that, sweetie. The entire Phillips family wants that delectable Eggo waffle. This could be close. Where'd it go? Wait a minute, let's see that again. The Eggo comes up, looking irresistible as ever, when... What's this? Granny gets the gold! What style! Even has time to savor the sweet taste of victory. Delicious Eggo waffles. Too delicious to let go. Did you know that eating hot dogs can make a kid 46% less likely to use drugs? Be a mentor. Make a difference. Tomorrow on General Hospital. I think Carly's feelings for you may go a lot deeper than you realize. Have the authorities been in touch? I can't avoid them forever. What if they ask me about you and Laura? How dare you put that chisel on my brother's desk? Dagger. Whatever. Tonight, a religious revival worshipers say is the answer to their prayers. Plus, is this a bizarre way to make a living or what? People renting their bodies to science, all on 2020. Then, John Larroquette guest stars as Dylan McDermott and Lara Flynn Boyle turn up Monday's a notch on The Practice, ABC Tonight. Can Luke and Laura's marriage survive their secrets and lies? Play the exclusive General Hospital Daily Poll at abc.com. You're watching ABC. Misty takes good care of her puppies, doesn't she, Mommy? Yes, she does. And we take good care of Misty. Like when we protect her with Frontline. Frontline. See, one spot right here gets rid of fleas and ticks that can make us sick. Does it hurt? No. Frontline's really gentle. You know how I know? Because you're a vegetarian. <laughs> veterinarian. Frontline. The flea and tick protection veterinarians trust most. No. That's what California newspapers say about Prop 226. The Los Angeles Times says 226 contains unadvertised consequences. The San Jose Mercury News calls 226 sneaky and unnecessary. The Riverside Press Enterprise says 226 creates a bureaucratic maze. Over 200 community groups, including the Organization of Police and Sheriffs, the League of Women Voters, the Sierra Club, the Cancer Society, and the Heart and Lung Associations urge you to vote no on 226. The real-world experience of a high-tech business leader, San Diego's Daryl Issa. One strike and you're out for adults selling drugs to our kids. More computers in schools. Dramatic tax reform. Daryl Issa. Endorsed by Bruce Hershenson. Endorsed by Ward Connerly. Endorsed by San Diego County Deputy Sheriffs. Endorsed by nearly every Republican legislator in San Diego County. The conservative Republican who can beat Barbara Boxer.
I'm his mother. You understand? And I don't want him thinking that Rob...